Uh, yeah, to, uh, we got a special guest comedian. He's actually going to be performing tomorrow night at a uh, Matrix in Rapongi. Unfortunately, the show is already sold out, so you don't already have tickets. But you lucky people, you're going to get a little preview, so you're going to at least get to see a little bit of this guy while he's coming through town, which is awesome. So he's come down here tonight. He's just going to give us like seven or ten minutes or something, you know, something around there. Something like that. Sure. Sure. Yeah. We're really tightly organized here, so you just, you know. Uh, we're, we're on rails. But anyways, uh, we're really glad to have him come by and uh, do a little touch. Not this guy. Fuck up. What are you doing? <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Josiah. All right. Uh, no, uh, let's welcome this stage. Uh, visiting in from the U.S., from Hawaii, I think. He'll clear it up. Ladies and gentlemen, here he is Paul Ogata. Yeah. Thank you, everybody. I wasn't even in town to do the show tomorrow night in the first place. That was not the, I, uh, when I was in the States, I went online on eBay. I don't know if you did have eBay in wherever you're from. <laughs> <laughs> and and where, where are you from? From France? Yeah. I'm sorry. And, <laughs> and I got an eBay and I bought uh, a used cyst and I... <laughs> And then uh, Wales, that's uh, incredibly brave of you, ma'am. Incredibly brave of you to come here knowing the, how much the Japanese hate Wales. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? What do they use the whales for? <laughs> Hunting. I don't see whale products in the store. <laughs> You go to Family Mart, there's, there's Coca-Cola, and there's no whale juice. <laughs> it's just the regular old stuff. All right. Uh, I, I don't, if there's people here from Japan, can you please pass this on to headquarters? Can you, can you tell them to stop using words that have taken on new meanings? Uh, I was at a ramen shop earlier today, and on the menu there was a... Bukake Udon, <laughs> which is means something else in America. I don't know, do they, do they have Bukake in France? Yes, yeah, of course. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> of course they do, because you have the internet, and it's amazing. Yeah. That's, that's what we learned. What Bukake? Bukake might mean tasty soup. <laughs> it means something. It means when a woman really, really loves thirteen or fourteen men. <laughs> <laughs> and is in desperate need of moisturizer. That's that's what we think of. I'm sure maybe in another day and age the Big Mac was called the double penetration sandwich. <laughs> but we no longer use that term for food. <laughs> I'm bad at Japanese. I don't understand Japanese. That's that's what I found most disturbing is that uh, all the Japanese people here, and to some extent even the rest of you, are upset that I don't speak Japanese. <laughs> people just walk up speaking their your booga booga language. <laughs> hey, booga booga, something, something, brother. I'm like, I, 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 don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't speak Japanese. <sighs> <laughs> and then they begrudgingly explain it in English. But it's it's like, how is that a letdown to them, sir? You're not Japanese, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, you are you Japanese? Okay. But you, you stay indoors a lot. <laughs> how are they let down by the fact that I don't speak Japanese? Like, it's in my, in my DNA, I'm hard-coded to speak Japanese, despite my... If I really, really try, I my genome. <laughs> Ooga booga, and apologize, and molest women on the train. <laughs> right, fantastic, that's not a good joke. <laughs> Bukake is so popular here in Japan, I mean, is it? Because that's all we know from the yeah, they, they probably like large facial features. <laughs> No? 
don't understand. Okay. <laughs> but look, you don't, either you don't understand or you disapprove of the joke. And either way, uh, uh, we're moving on. <laughs> Joke. All right, and you close the timer. I have no idea what to, when to stop doing jokes that fail. Right. This uh, is your time. Uh, More. Yes, this is my time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, I, I do have an affinity for this. Please don't show this ever on the internet, okay? Just, just use this at home. Just, I don't know how to do that. You don't know how to, to do what? <laughs> you don't know how to post that on YouTube or, or Vimeo or, or anywhere? Okay, good. Just use that for your own purposes when you're at home, lonely, just <laughs> <laughs> Put on the uh, put on the Ogata video and then uh, and rub one out, ma'am. That's all we're gonna do. And I know it's like a rock concert. You see a performer, as even as a comedy show, and women wanna get on the sh the performers afterwards. And you know, try your best. I'm married. It's not gonna work. You know, just get, do your best. Come on, rub your titties on my face. You're gonna fail. I encourage you to try. <laughs> I wasn't married, I have to hit up AshleyMadison.com after the show. There's a girl who has zero hits. <laughs> to make that happen. Here's why I really like Japan, is because simple flag, simple country. In Japan, white flag, red circle. It's simple. It tells you what you're to expect in the country. It like rice balls with umeboshi. That's it. <laughs> but the more difficult your flag gets, the shittier your country becomes. That's just science. <laughs> I don't know if you've seen the flag of Ecuador, but the Ecuador flag, very messy. And the country itself is in shambles. Their, their currency is devalued and worthless. Side note, they use American money. <laughs> Here's what's on the Ecuador flag. A bird, an axe, and four more flags of Ecuador! <laughs> like some optical illusion, the closer you get to a flag, you see four more flags. <laughs> As you know, Haiti is a terrible country. Here's what's on the flag of Haiti. Six rifles, six bayonets, an axe, two cannons, and six spears. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> I know it's dangerous in Haiti, but is it that hard to draw earthquakes and AIDS on your flag? <laughs> Here's what's on the flag of Samoa. Samoa is full of poverty. Here's what's on the Samoan flag. An eagle. They don't have eagles in Samoa! Why not have other shit that does not exist in Samoa on your Samoan flag? Like petite women. Put that on your flag. Samoan literacy. If you can spell it, put that on your flag. I have 30 more minutes of flag jokes. I did these series of jokes last November in Malaysia, and uh, so here's a little backstory on our flags. Virtually the same flag, 13 red and white stripes and a blue box in the corner with some shit on it, all right? <laughs> now, uh, the Malaysian guy comes up to me after the show, having heard all these flag jokes, he says, your country sucks because your flag is too difficult. You have too many stars, you have 50 stars, we have one star and the moon. I'm like, oh. Good job, Malaysia. <laughs> you put the moon on your flag. Oh, we put our flag on the fucking moon. <laughs> <laughs> Just me and the Navy guy. <laughs> are you? What, are you Navy? Is that what? Navy. It? Yeah. Navy. Hell yeah, man. And what rank are you? Uh, lieutenant. Uh, lieutenant? Yeah. Is it officer? I am. Okay, oh, shit! Right, so, uh, what, what rank is next for you? Uh, lieutenant commander. Oh, lieutenant commander. And then what? Commander something? They just keep tagging on? They're just switching off names? Pick a rank. Don't just add on another word. What do you mean? Like a sequential noun rank? Just be the next thing. Don't be half you and half like a werewolf. <laughs> Alright, and so lieutenant uh, in the Navy, what, so, uh, what ship are you on? Uh, I'm on shore duty. Oh, you're on shore, shore duty. <laughs> <laughs> you must suck in the Navy if they don't ask you. <laughs> Can I come on? No, hold the rope. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you've seen the... Uh, do the French have a... a, a military? <laughs> I was just wondering. And you were taking a while to answer that, I thought maybe you were going to be like, I give up, because that's what you think. <laughs> <laughs> so, are you guys
guys all French? Oh, oh, British. I, I like that. Yeah, that when you spoke, you said that sentence, I could tell because you, you eh, British. <laughs> they just, but they keep going. <laughs> well, why, what is that? That's just like a verbal spooge at the end. <laughs> Like a 69 Chevy Nova with a bad timing chain that won't shut down. <laughs> I like that. Not very sexy, but on a woman, the British accent, very sexy. Oh my god. It's my ultimate fantasy to shag, 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 shag a, a British, uh, yeah, a bird, British bird, yeah, with a really big vagina. Just. <laughs> don't judge, don't judge. <laughs> Just so that in the moment of intimacy she can tell me in her sexy voice, please mind the gap. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys, don't go.